mentioned Holly to you before, right? Hi, here I am. <laughs> There's something you need to know. And this is the guest room. Holly and I, we fooled around. You had sex with your college roommate? It was a one-time thing. That happened five or six times. Wow. Who could it be? Don't look at me. You have a threesome opportunity in your very near future. It's <laughs> great. I can't stop thinking about it. Well, make it happen. If she gets our way, things get out of control. Maybe getting a little out of control would be good for us. Okay. Yes! So yeah. good. One, two, three, turn around. You're still the best friend I have had. Turn around. Do you prefer having sex with her or having sex with me? With you. Took too long to answer. Just turn around. It's not about Holly. This is about us. No would like us to have a threesome. I'm totally into it. How do you feel? On a scale of one to ten, how much do you want to? This is a bizarre conversation. Ten. Ten out of ten. The card didn't work? Your father's frozen all of your assets. How much money are we talking about here exactly? A million dollars. A million dollars? Have you thought more about my proposal? There is no way I'm gonna work for you in China. After one year, I give you your money back. Oh my god, this is not really happening. Try and look happy. I don't want them to see you acting like this. My life is over. How am I supposed to act? You will attach the tag to the toys. A monkey could do this job. You will fit right in. Ugh. Our business is a family business. No, oh, your business. Your family owes you absolutely nothing. You used to have the coolest products. Then you became one of those lazy Chinese guys that keeps knocking each other off. This factory will have to close down. <laughs> The designers and I have been working on some new concepts. It's not really how we do things around here. We could make up our own rules. I suppose we can give it a try. Really? Despite all his flaws, he really does have a kind heart. Cool, yeah? <laughs> sure, cool. <laughs> What's your name? King Lu. They call me Cookie. My mother died when I was born, and then my father died. I never stopped moving. It's the getting started that's the puzzle. No way for a poor man to start. You have a cow. First cow in the territory. It's ain't a place for cows. Well, it's no place for a white man either. I sense opportunity here. Give me another. I'll give you six ingots for that last one. I taste London in this game. We have to take what we can when the taking is good. It seems dangerous. So is anything worth doing? A royal cow. And yet she barely produces a thing. Some people can't imagine being stolen from. Let's hope he's one of those. got a window here, Cookie. History isn't here yet. It's coming, but maybe this time we can take it on our own terms. What should I know about you? Um, you're a writer. Pitch me. Dare I ask where you last worked? I worked in the mayor's office. Dave, I've been working for more than a year now. I just, I think that I could be really useful with this sort of thing. You know you don't get to be editor on day two just because you showed up on day one. Hello? Uh, hello? Hi. You called, but said you wanted to meet in person about your story. We're not taking the story unless we can see the video. Can you imagine the uproar? Hey, sorry, do you work here? I'm just an assistant. So how does this video come your way? What am I looking at? It's a good story. Everyone's story is always a good story until it's not. Well, if you like it, I'm pitching it. Oh, Jesus Christ. You have to give me a couple of days before you do anything here. Do you think it's real? I don't know. When you're asked your opinion, you have to have one. 
What were you looking for? Um, I don't know. I thought that maybe somebody might know something. Do you know what kind of traffic is composed of the site? You won't use my name. I really hope whoever tells your story tells it right. Maybe you're just not a very good journalist. One of them is going to get it. They say how much the guy was asking, we could offer them more. Offer them more? Pitch me. Maybe you're just not a very good journalist. If you come out with this, that's my story. This is insane. Pitch me. It's not your story. They got to it first. You know what happens if this leaks? If it leaks? Pitch me. Seriously, this is my story. Maybe you're just not a very good journalist. You do not pitch stories. You are assigned things. It was just another day. It's just another woman. <laughs> Another story for you to bury. And that's everything you know. Is he gonna lose his job? He's the mayor. Is that a yes or no? Do I make you happy? I'm the happiest man in the whole world. I feel so lucky. You're not mad at me? Mom, we're pregnant. About what? I just want to make sure I'm not doing anything wrong. You couldn't do anything wrong, even if you tried. So what did you do for money before you met my son? Retail, mostly. A lucky break. I'm just real grateful. Fake it till you make it. Are you happy? Or are you pretending? How does it make you feel when you swallow something? I just like the textures in my mouth. The textures in my mouth. It made me feel in control. In control. Uh, I'm right here. I just wanted to make you happy. You get back here with my kid! I did something unexpected today. I have something for you from your dad. This brings him back. Like back to life? The film Onward is a tale of two brothers trying to finally meet their father. I'm gonna meet dad? They perform this spell, which will hopefully bring their dad back. Hang on! It's a pretty great concept that has so much heart. Dad? Ah, there's no top part! And that's exactly what Pixar does so well. We've only got 24 hours to bring back the rest of dad. When Chris got the role, he called Tom and said, I'm your brother. <laughs> this is so fun, Tom. I mean, it is fun. The best part of the job was the fact that I got to do it with my buddy Chris. For any spell to work, you have to speak from your heart's fire. Oh, Olaf Delavar! Heart's fire! <laughs> <laughs> I love these two whippersnappers. And as the mother of two teenage boys, I have that in common with Laurel because that's been the joy of my life. Now take out the trash. Family is important. I'm looking for my sons. Oh, they went on a quest. But don't worry, I told them about the map. I told them about the gym. I told them about the curse. <gasps> I forgot to tell them about the curse. The what? This definitely pulls at the heartstrings. I just want to meet you. That's why I love Pixar movies. You always walk away feeling like you've been a part of something real. <laughs> at Pixar, we're really encouraged to tell personal stories. My father passed away when I was a year old. So when you're making a personal story, you get to delve into something that's real and encouraging for other people. You can do this. I believe in you. It's moving because it's rooted in real relationships. <laughs> and that's the fun of making one of these movies is at some point it's the story of all the people who helped make it. 
and then it becomes the story of all the people who watch it. A big project here, building a house? Guest house. You got somebody for the job? We build, we clean, we fix. We can do it for cheaper. He needs a hospital. I could get into a lot of trouble with the police for hiring illegals. What? He goes all around. Loses the trabajo. Yeah, I'm done. Why are you working? You have no pay us. Why would I pay you when you haven't finished your job? Listen, guys, you do your work, be no problems, okay? We build your houses for you, and you bury us in them. Who did all the work? Undocumented workers. Really? Yeah, a lot of those guys are out of work. Sir,对于抓捕犯罪嫌疑人周泽农提供重要线索者，警方将给予人民币三十万元的奖励。很有可能就藏在这一带，他们应该给予了业务。是一个三不惯的地带，拉过都相惯，但是拉过都管不好。Wondering why I called you over here. I didn't need to go where a Bible went. Our basketball coach had a heart attack the other night. We need a new coach, Jack. And you know your gifts seem heaven sent. Is the team any good? No. The last time they made the playoffs, back when you were playing. Let's go, line up. You're Marcus, right? That's right. How many threes did Marcus make last year? A percentage of 26. Yeah. You want to know why they're leaving you open? It's because they don't think you could hit the ocean from the beach. <laughs> Yo, he just spit backs at your ass, bro. <laughs> I don't know how you house the sin. So how you liking coaching so far? Great. Just getting used to the players. What players? I was never sure how much of you I could let in. I heard you're coaching basketball. Yeah. Keeps me busy. Keeps my mind off other things, you know. Once you settle down, baby, here you love is big. I spent a lot of time hurting myself. I made a lot of bad decisions. I had a lot of regrets. Game's on the line. I want you taking that shot. Why is that so hard for you to believe? What? That you're the best player on the team. I know you're suffering. I just want you to be happy again. But you gotta want it too. 
pressing, trapping, taking charges. You guys earned this tonight. you numerous times what it is you do for a living that's causing so much of this anxiety Remember I told you that I did something before I worked in the protection department I worked in collections do I know you man best specialist I have. What's going on? Last one was a tough one. Ain't they all? You know they're gonna come after you. Nobody well, we said this job was easy. Now, nobody in this business wants to work, but somebody's gotta do it. She could have died. And they all could have died. That's the name no, of the game. No, no, look, I can't live with myself if someone dies on my watch. Tell me what it used to be. Mickey, at very least you have an anger problem. Growing up under apartheid meant a life built on lies and indifference. But unless we got up from our privileged white lives and did something, our words were meaningless. Hey, you! You are sentenced to imprisonment for 12 years. We are prisoners of conscience. Well, we're prisoners of war. I won't give up. So there have been attempts. Some go a little, some a little more, but no one go out. Always a first time. Ah! We need to get out of here. Everybody comes in here like I'm gonna break out of here by next week. If you're having a plan, I join you. We've got something. We make keys from wood. That's too crazy. Searchlights covers every inch of the yard. Bores with guns. There's nothing they'd like more than to pump holes into you. There is something, and I will find it. I won't give up. Don't you ever sleep through my bed again! I won't give up. Why won't you come? Got a lock, we can make a key. They are not in your senses! You fail, get 25 years if you're lucky. A bullet in the head if you're not. Don't shoot! I won't give up. <laughs> We're not running away. Let's stay, fight. This is how we fight. been here before. The sighing sound. You have been mine before. Hello, stranger. Hello, mom. Hello, stranger. <laughs> Hello, mom. I can't bear to think you're unhappy, Jamie. I'm fine. Fine isn't the same as happy. No, we're happy, aren't we, Edward? Yes, we're fine. I'm going to leave. 
you'll be better off without me. I don't want to be here when you do it. You can't just walk away after 29 years. You have to try. I have tried for 29 years. No. If I had to blame you for anything, it would be letting her think that you were happy. You think maybe you'll walk back through that door? It really could happen. Mom, he's in love! So if your life hurts you so much, I won't stop you. I mean, what gave you the right? That's enough. I thought there were three unhappy people. And now there's only one. <laughs> His name is Edward. Stay, Edward. Stay. <laughs> oh, who's this? Come, Edward. What? Not you. If we get a divorce, I get less than if he died. Oh, yes. So it would be better for me if you were dead. <laughs> Why don't we see ghosts every day? Oh, leave me alone. Most hauntings are so small, they go unnoticed. Hi, this is Rose's driving school. Maybe you could chat with my daughter just to find out what's up with her. My name is Martin. Oh, Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Martin, she's floating. She's floating, Martin. I know. What is evil? <laughs> Coming, my sweet. I'm doing an incantation. Bloody rich. Yes. This is a satanic ritual. Satanist. I woke up in the morning. To break the spell, you need ectoplasm. Yeah. Oh, you just have to yeah. let the ghost inhabit your body. Like in Ghostbusters. Oh, I haven't read that. Just the plot to thicken in your life. Why does it have to be so unnecessarily gross? Black magic. Uh -huh. Yo, girls, come with something. Great. Say, Spence. Not much. How's it feel getting out? We have a little going away message for you. For me? Give him hell, Spencer. Gotcha. You made it. Try and stay on this side for a while. Let's go see your girlfriend. Five years ago, you got yourself sent to prison. What was I supposed to do, wait? I'm sorry. I love you! How do you like that? Let's go! Yo! Henry! What? You said I'd have my own room. Look, this is Spencer. Spencer, this is Hawk. You two are gonna be roommates. I'd like you two to get to know each other. Mi amigo! Hey, que pasa? Or you just got out? You're in big trouble. For what? You smashed the car to a restaurant! It's time you tell me what's really going on here. Picture this. Dirty cops, drug cartels, some big politicians all working together. When I was a cop, I was trying to take these guys down. But they framed me. So what's the plan? We're gonna blow this wide open. You want in? No, 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 no. You don't get the cold gun. Hawk is the name of a man with a shotgun. 
Spencer does your taxes. That was good. I'm gonna let you have your little gun. Who said you did that on fire as soon as he got free? You never learn your lesson, do you? You were gonna do what was right with your strong moral code. This isn't a buy for Boy Scouts. I thought you knew how to punch. There were five of them. Bring them out, bring them out. You're about to walk barefoot to the gates of hell. That's how you throw a punch! Holy shit! You got two grown men running around playing Batman. Robin. <laughs> and Alfred over here. Go for me, Alfred. Hey! You're not really how I imagine an art critic would look. Can't tell me you never wanted to paint. <laughs> Seriously, what did you want to be when you were a kid? Well, I was never a kid. You're one of those. On a wedge. A liar. Yeah. Ever heard of Joseph Cassidy? The art dealer? Mm-hmm. Been invited to his estate. You got rich friends. If you could interview any living artist, who do you think it would be? At the edge of my property, there's a dilapidated little house. In this house, there's an artist. No critic has spoken to this guy in over 50 years. Jerome Debney. It's an honor, Mr. Debney. Think of the splash it would make. See and describe his current work. No, no, no. I cannot abide such things. You could be running a major museum soon. And why would you do this for me? I'd value a deadly jabs. And I'd like you to procure one for me. What is this about? Redemption, embezzlement, and forgery. Kind of underhanded, don't you think? You know what we need to do. Most people are not what you'd expect. You know, don't you? They won't. It's true. True. Come on. Give me a key. Nós temos que procurar Bacurau no mapa, né? Ué, era pra estar aqui. Cadê Bacurau? Boa tarde, amigos de Bacurau. Cada um pode vir aqui pegar o mantimento que precisar, tá? Vamos usar a consciência, tá bom? So this is Bacurau. Bacurau é o quê? É gente. Cara, é trarinho, velho. Aqui nessa terra não pode acontecer dessa forma, não, viu? A gente está sendo atacado. There's so much you can do with a knife. This world is upside down. Vamos a hablar de los crímenes de los durmientes. Bienvenido a casa. Oh, 
verás, han cambiado algunas cosas por aquí en tu ausencia. Un placer conocerle, inspectora Ayala. La postura de las víctimas es exactamente la misma. No le importa lo que son, sino lo que representan. Este asesinato es una réplica de los anteriores. Me temo que ha vuelto a empezar. No vamos a encontrar huellas. Demasiado meticuloso. Estás demasiado expuesto, Neil. Quiero que me acompañes a donde empezó todo. Pensaba que teníamos un trato. No me gusta nada que vayáis por libre. ¿Ahora los tortolitos vienen juntos o qué? A mí no me engañas, ¿eh? Algo se nos está escapando. ¿Sabes por qué te elegí? Tú no me elegiste. ¿Qué está pasando? ¡Sal de ahí ya! Y lo está consiguiendo. Sigue jugando con nosotros. My name is Nanki. They say find your tribe. Love them hard. VJ. Tashi, Hardy, that's my tribe. We were having the time of our lives. Until... Let's start from the beginning. St. Martin's. We go to our friendships. Did you? Did you stop it? For attitude. Did you? If you want, you can go to my backstage. I'm the songwriter. Oh. गर्लफ्रेंड कर लिए थे तुम्हें। अपने पैशन के लिए एंड वी लाइक टू लिव इट वाइल्ड बट दिस स्टोरी इज ऑफ द डार्केस्ट नाइट ऑफ आर लाइफ तनु कुमार ने ट्वीट किया है कि विजय प्रताप सिंह ने वैलेंटाइन डेट की रात को उसका रेप किया है उसका रेप करूंगा भी क्यों यार या किसी का भी क्यों आई गर्लफ्रेंड मुझे आई प्रिविलेज है इट्स अ फैक्ट डज ही एक्सप्लोइट इट आई डोंट थिंक सो वो लड़की झूठ बोल रही है so it was consensual. 100%. हमको इज्जत से जीने का उतना ही हक है जितना किसी बड़े बाप की औलाद को नीचा दिखाते हैं हमें ये अपर क्लास इंग्लिश मीडियम वाले इन तीनों में से कौन क्या छुपा रहे तनु विजय और नान की क्या आपने रिवेंज प्लान किया था अपने इवन से सब लाइक मैं बोल रहा हूं कल डिफेंस बोलेगा दैट एक्सक्यूज मी Robert Martin has offered me his hand. Do you advise me? Oh no, no, no. The words must be your own. You must be the best judge of your own happiness. I have now quite determined and really almost made up my mind to refuse Mr. Martin. Emma Mr. Knightley. This is your doing. She is the natural daughter of nobody knows. Sorry, Mr. Knightley. Upon my word, you should not make matches. Whatever you say always comes to pass. Mr. Elton, Miss Harriet Smith. <laughs> He's in love with you. Well, who can think of Miss Smith when Miss Woodhouse is near? <laughs> Mr. Elton. Oh dear. She always declares that she will never marry. I have no thoughts of matrimony at present. Which of course means just nothing at all. You must never be my Emma. Good heavens, have I missed the party? He spent a whole day going to London just to get his hair cut. He's a trifling silly fop. Huh? Emma, they're here. With whom will you dance? Mother, you must. Sample the tart. <laughs>